Right then guys, I can hear machinery in the background somewhere and uh, so can Vinny, he's not convinced. I don't know what that noise is, but I don't like it. That sort of attitude. So, let's go through here anyway. As you can see, the part of this forest gets a little bit dark. There's all overhanging trees everywhere. So we go through here. This is a nice little spot. We've already seen that sign that says cattle, be aware. That's June. We're now halfway through September, believe it or not. Come on, Vinny. Good boy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Good boy. Good boy. Max, I'll oh, come out of the way. Are we going to get this worked out today? Oh, Vinny's through. Right, off you go. Go on in. Good boy. Right. Now, where's he gone? Now, where's the other bloke? Oh, here he is. Right. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. What a pillover. Yeah, the sun's been up for a couple of hours. It's around about whoa, 10 past 8, quarter past 8 in the morning on a Thursday. I think it's about the 14th of September 2023. And uh, yeah, forest. Nice little forest. Broxbourne Woods. But then again, we call it the Sculpture Trail. This is a lovely little walk. You can't get lost, unlike the other forests. We've been lost in that at least two or three times. As I keep reminding people, there's a, an app. It's a free app. And it's called Map My Walk. So if you set that up before you go anywhere, you cannot get lost. It works for people walking, cycling, and also people driving. And if he goes in there, I'm going to shoot one of them. This is a little like swamp type pond. And uh, it's kept like this simply for frogs, newts, and things like that. And the water, after a while, as you can imagine, because it doesn't move, doesn't go anywhere, becomes stagnant and it stinks. And to show people that they have a sense of humour, they thought of this idea, they put a couple of chairs in there so they can have a sit down. Oh, what a lot of fag, aren't they, would you? <laughs> just like, poof, poof. Where's all that gas come from? They work for me, that's for sure. Yeah, there's a little bench over there, see what I'm saying? Hey. There's a bench there. There's another one somewhere, I don't know where that's disappeared. It's un under there somewhere, you have to trust me on that. But, um, like I say, no, out, out! Don't you, don't you even, oh my good old giddy on, don't you even think of it. How did you get in there? That's normally all fenced off. Oh, that's a close one. Whew, oh, the gate's open. There's an only sty and it's shut. But not today. Today we're going to test Alex's patience. No, we're not. Yes, we are. All right. Dear, oh dear, oh dear. Whoever next. Oh, silly place to leave a hole. I say it's nice through here. You get cows wandering over this side. There's a bigger field over there where the trees are and like I say British Longhorn from the 1950s they was facing extinction uh, introduction of introduction of other cows different types and uh, Longhorn is all rounder meat and milk uh, didn't produce as much as the other cows so yeah, there's some bright spot I thought no we're going to keep this I kept breeding them and breeding them and luckily enough, they're around to date for people to see. Yeah, it's an old ancient breed. It goes right back to the sort of Stone Age, I think. It goes back to the Stone Age. Not too sure, to be honest with you. But it's a very old breed. British Longhorn. Not to be confused with American Longhorn, honey. Ha uh ha. -huh. No. Oh. No, not with that lot. He's, he's coping quite well. I'm quite pleased with him today. All right, so far so good. Maxi, come. Good boy, good boy, good boy. But he's gone off onto the left. Come on, come on, come close, come close. Good boy, Vinny, good boy, Vinny. That's a good boy, that's a good boy. Plenty of praise. As long as he comes within reach, that's all you need to know. That's all you need to know. As long as they come within reach, and you can grab hold of him, put your lead on him. Perfect. 
no, that shouting and swearing, all that old nonsense. Uh, at the end of the day, if somebody's shouting and swearing at you, would you want to go towards them or go the other way? You certainly won't come towards them, would you? So it's the same principle, really. Good little voice, plenty of praise. Come, 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 come. Yeah, one of them silly little voices, isn't it? Well, it's a good one to leave. <laughs> you know, you're in my power. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, words to that effect. Yeah, it's nice through here. This is Al. My Al. She's my uh, missus. Alison. She hates being called Alison. Don't call me Alison. My name's Al. Uh, it's like, yeah, get all right. Strange woman. Uh, no, she, this is her little spot. She loves this spot. It's very overgrown. And uh, when she sees this later on, she goes, oh my God, it's not the same place. I said, it is. Yeah, where's the little bench? Say, so, little bench is just over there hiding. Hiding behind there somewhere. Just, just about make the bench out. I think. Is it there? Or is it there? It's around there somewhere. <laughs> like I say, it vanished. It's under there. Trust me, it's under there. Right. Onward. Forever onward. Right, well, now we're going to take a chance. Big, huge chance. And we're going to go a little bit into the forest now. As I said before, Vinny's coping very, very well. And Max being Max, he's been an absolute diamond. He's protecting Vinny, making sure he's keeping up where he is, what he's doing. Doesn't look like it, but he is. And uh, obviously Vinny is following Max. A good idea is, Max comes to me, Vinny follows Max, I'll grab hold of Vinny, and everyone's happy. Perfect. Absolutely perfect. We go straight over. Come on in. What do you mean? Oh, Vinny got through. What can't you get through? What do you mean you're too big? Yeah, oh dear, oh dear. Oh. Gate. Ugh. Dunk. Right, come on in. Come on, come on. As I say, we're just going into the forest a little bit. Um, I'm expecting Max to be better than 100%. And I'm simply expecting Vinny to keep up. Remembering, he's not even six months old yet. He's not doing bad, not doing bad at all. And everything here is mahoosely larger than Vinny. Including all the weeds and the bracken, everything is bigger. A salad, salad bowl again, eh? Yeah, right. In the winter, all this stuff here you can see, that's all mud. And it's, yeah, it's slippery, soft. And you sink up to your ankle sometimes if you ain't careful. Well, that's my foot down there. So if you can imagine stepping down there, that's a lot of mud. Oh, uh, we don't go this way in the winter. <laughs> we go, we go a different route. <laughs> so I've been through there, and you get down to it, and you think, I'm halfway. Now, do I go back or do I go forward? That's the problem. That is the question, isn't it? What way do you go? Uh, yeah, you just go forward, don't you? You're going to become suddenly more cleaner, are you? You've got caked in mud and everything else. Ah, it don't matter, does it? It'll wash off. It's not as if you've got to go to church, is it, in your, in your finest clothes? Uh, see, there's a little stream that comes through here sometimes. That's muddy. Everything, everything through this route is mud. I don't think see Vinny, can you? I think that's, no, that's Max coming to Wallsby. You can just see Vinny. Here he is. <laughs> all right, mate. All right, all right, all right. Come on, come on, let's go. Come on, come on. Come on. Here, oh dear. I don't like it. I don't like it. I don't like it. I can't see where I'm going. Max. Good boy. Uh, finally, we're coming to a path, and uh, yeah, I'm impressed with Vinny. I'm absolutely impressed with him today. Um, we'll run into one little doggy, 
They're beautiful. No problems there whatsoever, apart from Max being over enthusiastic, sniffing as usual. Other than that, no, fantastic job. Got to socialise him. Hopefully with sensible dogs. What are you going? You going that way, are you? What? I don't know. What are you going to go? You going that way? What do you mean you can hear something? I can't hear nothing. What do you mean? Could be a crocodile in there. There's nothing in there. There's nothing. There's a big spider's web. There's nothing else in there, mate. Strange dog. It's amazing since the last time we come here how much this has overgrown. It has gone absolutely ballistic this year. I suppose you had some heat, a lot of rain, cold temperature, and it's just perfect environment, I suppose. Perfect sort of weather. Ah, birch. It's native to the UK. It's been here since the Stone Age. I know that. <laughs> The other stuff over there, that's all pine. That's mostly from the Middle East. It's not native to the UK. Oh. Uh, a few years ago, they was going to get rid of all the pine trees and reintroduce the British trees, such as the oaks and the elms and ash, and things like that. Never happened. Uh, um, too many trees and too expensive. Lots of these ideas were on paper. Brilliant. In reality, nah, they're lousy ideas, aren't they? Yeah, one of those things. This is going to be a mahoosive film. We're going to do four parts. Ah, right, okay. Let's do part four. Part four coming up, guys. Oh, no. Yeah, sorry, pals.